you can see, it's all up and running. Fish are looking fairly active, always looking for some food. <laughs> but um, yeah, she's all up and running. Skimmer's pulling well. Um, so, what's next for Rocket Boy apart from cladding that side, that side, and the back? Plans are the wooden pond there is uh, Vince is going to come over and assist me to turn it into a gravity fed system. So that will be where all the uh, fish that I um, I want to move on or I don't want in the main pond will go. And the IBC will then be turned into a quarantine system. So yes, looking good. The old shower's running well. Everything seems to be dry around here but we did have some trials and tribulations and uh, as I said I can't thank Vince enough but task for today I promise Lynn I'll do it is tidy up the conservatory shouldn't take too long it is a bit of a mess but Bless her, she's been very, very supportive. Uh, spare pump down there, look. 10,000 Evolution Aqua Pump. Bit of spare pipe work. Move that as well. Um, yeah, I've just rectified the uh, moving bed. I did have a dead spot in it, but... Uh, as you can see now, she's a moving like a good one. Two air stones in there. I had to modify that a little bit. Bit of East Robinson, but it works. It goes up, out of the way, look. And straight down into that. Just move some gravel round and put a bit of gravel round here. Which looks a bit better. Cleaning pipe for the this easy pod, and the cleaning pipe for that easy pod, and that one is up there. That's air for these little babies. They're all doing okay. But yeah, major clean up. Uh, I'm not going to be touching that too much. But yeah, Vince keeps on <laughs> get rid of this net, but I will do. Lynn's just, uh, I've just got to convince her that the fish ain't going to jump. They're all looking happy. I have. The air source heat pump was set to 20. Well, I don't know whether you can see that. I've knocked it down to 14. The pond temperature is 17 at the moment. So it's gradually dropping down. Help save her electric. She keeps moaning at me about the cost of the electric. Uh, just got to tie all this up a little bit round here. Broken slab there, but it's not going to work. Clean the air pump up a bit because it's migging. Put the electric around there. And that is just to keep any moisture out covered with a bag this one well I've got a pond vac so I think I'll keep that there got to take the OV1 thing in that's the top return for the pond yeah Skimmer's working well, that's working well, give it a few days and I'll give it a clean, um, 
but I did promise her I would tidy the conservatory up. I better keep my promise. And then we've got a tip run book for Saturday. So hopefully we can get rid of a lot of that junk. There's a sheet of polyst polystyrene there to go on the, the back. We've got one on that side, the front there, one on that side. Just spoke to Baz, Baz might pop down and uh, see me. Sure he would like that, like to see it all up and running, because he did help carry it in. Thankfully it's dried up a bit round here. Yeah, this has got to be tidied as well. Some useful wood there. Some bricks, slabs, all sorts. But I'm going to make a little step there, I think. Anyway, me top ups return. I've got to sort out my uh, drain system. I don't know where all the pipes gone for that. It's somewhere. I think I took some of it out round here. Yes, I did. Because uh, I'm going to need that for cleaning because I don't want to flood all behind here. But yeah, jobs are good and I will put a little box around there. Probably out a bit just to cover that. Just cool the pipes. Not leaking now. And as I said, that's bubbling like a good one. Happy days. Anyway, turn you around. Slightly a stressed rocket boy. <laughs> anyway, catch you later. <laughs>